Hello what's up guys welcome to the new video. Today we will learn that how to solve the system of three linear equations using the Kramer's rule. Here we have the three linear equations x plus 2y is equal to 6, 2x plus z is equal to 7, 3y plus 4z is equal to 6. First of all we have to write down its coefficient in a matrix form. Now here you can see the coefficient of x is 1 and the coefficient of y is 2 the coefficient of z is 0 because there is no any uh, z in this equation similarly in the second equation coefficient of x is 2 the coefficient of y is 0 and the coefficient of z is 1 in this equation there is no any coefficient of x it will be 0 so the coefficient of y will be 3 and the coefficient of z is 4 First of all, we have to determine its determinant. We hide the corresponding uh, row and the corresponding column and we write the remaining numbers. For example, here 1, the remaining will be 0, 1, 3 and 4. In the same way, minus 2 of the formula, we hide the corresponding column and the corresponding row. The remaining will be 2, 1, 0, and 4 similarly plus 0 and we hide that column corresponding to 0 and that row corresponding to 0 okay the remaining will be 2 0 0 and 3 okay what we do that we write uh, its determinant 1 0 multiply by 4 will be 0 minus 3 multiply 1 will be 3 minus 2 2 multiply 4 will be 8 minus 0 multiply 1 will be 0 plus 0 okay it will be minus 3 minus 2 multiply 8 will be minus 16 minus 3 minus 16 will be minus 19 now what we do that we determine the three determinants how we replace the first column with 6 7 and 6 okay we write the remaining columns same as it is 2 0 3 and 0 1 4 similarly we determine its determinant what will be the determinant minus 62 in the same way we will write the determinant of y okay we write the coefficients of x as it is and the coefficient of y what we do we replace these values 6 7 6 and the third column which, which was the coefficient of the z it will be same as it is similarly we will find out its determinant the answer will be minus 26 in the same way now we come to the coefficients of z okay dz is equal to 1 2 0 2 0 3 and 3 and we will replace this coefficient of z with respect to these values 6 7 and 6 similarly we will find out its determinant now you know that as we have found out the determinant is equal to minus 19 dx is equal to minus 62 dy is equal to minus 26 and dz is equal to minus 9 so we have to find out now the values of x y and z and what will be the value of x determinant of x that will be dx divided by d will be minus 62 divided by minus 19 y is equal to dy divided by d it will be minus 26 divided by minus 19 z is equal to dz by d will be minus 9 divided by minus 19 so the solution set will be the values of x y and z that is 62 by 19 to 26 by 19 and 9 by 19 thank you for watching this video